everybody and welcome back to my channel um, it's been a minute since I made a video I'm sorry if you are somebody that watches my videos a lot I'm very sorry but I've just had a lot going on in my life and I was just coming back on here to make a new video about my makeup and some of the stuff that I have purchased so let's just get to it and I'm sorry if you can see the boxes in the background but we have been building our own house so then boxes are just a lot of the stuff that we have bought um, we just put in a new fireplace so we're gonna use, we're just gonna burn them boxes in our new fireplace so uh, let's just get to this video here is one of my brushes I ordered this off of Wish and I also ordered this one off of Wish. Here they are. They are super cute. Look at this one. Look how cute. It's like unicorn, I think it said. Unicorn. And it is soft. It's so glittery. Like you could feel a little texture on it. But look at that brush. Okay, and then there's this one. This one is just like a diamond type thing. It feels like it has a little texture. It's uh, it's smooth, but it has like these little ridges in it. But it is it is purple and pink and blue. The top is just purple. Okay, so with those brushes out of the way we have these brushes I picked these up at Marshall's which is a branch of TJ Maxx I'm pretty sure I picked these up these are unicorn brushes it said um, I guess uh, they are I'm not sure they didn't say so I guess like foundation brush and stuff and like a little mascara I mean not mascara I'm so sorry but um, a little eyeshadow brush and then like a foundation brush or something and um, I guess like a powder brush or maybe the other one was a powder brush and this one might have been the foundation brush but that's all three of them they are super cute they have the gold I think it's actually it's either gold or rose gold around here and then these are pink. They're a little bit dirty at the moment because I use them. Okay, so I have two beauty blenders. One I got for Christmas, which I'm pretty sure that I have a video of it already. It is a little bit tougher, uh, more firm. And I like it and everything. I got this one for Christmas. And then I got this one at Marshall's a few days ago on my anniversary. And it is so soft. I love it. I love the other one as well, but like that one's just so soft. It blends my makeup so good. I also have several things that I picked up that was on sale at my local Magic Mart that has sold out. Like it's went out of business. And um, I picked these up there because they were having a sale, trying to sell everything out of the store. And uh, I'm just going to show all of this stuff together. I don't think there's any more. Let's see. There's one more liquid lip or, I mean, lip liner. Sorry, lip liner. But I do not know what I did with it. I was doing a Freddy look for Halloween as... Um, just a makeup tutorial on how I do the Freddy and uh, I misplaced that lip liner so I'm sorry about that but this is a lot of the stuff I picked up there I'm going to show it all okay so I am sorry if I'm going too fast or anything but this is one of the mascaras it is a dark purple 
It is the Jordina Made in U.S. Dramatic Effects Mascara. It is dark purple. It is actually Powerful Plum. Is the name 54. So I hope you could see that. But this is what it looks like when it comes out. That was that one. This is the Jordina Made in U.S. Dramatic Effect Mascara. This is Sapphire Chick. Sapphire Chick 56. Okay, this is what it looks like. It's more like a metallic blue. That's it. Okay. We have another one. This is the Jordina Made in U.S. Mascara Black 01. This is what it looks like. Okay. So, one more. This is... No, two more. Sorry, I'm sorry. Two more. This is the Jordina Dramatic Effect Mascara. This is 55 Vivid Violet. Okay, there's the front. Okay, here it is. Let's open this up. And there it is, the purple. It's very nice. It's very pretty. Okay. This one is my favorite. And I'm sorry if you see the eyeshadow up here. Well, I'm not, I can't really be sorry, but there's eyeshadow up here because I had previously did this video and it was on my phone. I kept dropping my phone during the video and I just deleted it. And now I have my camera set up. I lost my tripod and I have my camera my T7i, my Rebel, Canon Rebel T7i, I have it set up on a bunch of books right now, so, because I lost my tripod. But this is the, the pink, I'm so sorry, the pink mascara. This is the same brand, the, I'm um, sorry. Jordina Dramatic Effect Mascara. This is in 52 Fearless Fuchsia. And that's what it looks like. Let's see. But it is nice. I love putting this on. I might even just let me see here. Use this real quick. Okay. No, I might even just go ahead and put this on real quick. Look at that. Oh my god. That, oh my god, this is just so amazing. I just put this on one eye so far. <laughs> I didn't put it on the other eye. Okay. So some more things. This is still the stuff that I picked up at the uh, Mart, um, Magic Mart, sorry. This is the Jordina Twisted and Shine uh, Moisturizing Balm Stain. 03 Tropical Frenzy is the, um, I guess the name. Let's see, okay. See, there's the name. Twist and Shine, Tropical Frenzy. Okay, so that was one more thing. Like I said, there are several things that I picked up from there. This is the LA Colors Liquid Eyeliner. This is blue. Oh, let me see. Like the print has came off of this. Let's see. Yeah, Liquid Eyeliner LA Colors. But it's came off. Um, I don't even... I can't even read like what color or anything but I know it's blue 
Like, I know it's blue. But there it is. It's like a navy blue. And I have an extra one. This is smudge proof liquid eyeliner. Uh, it does not actually say what color on here that I could see. Let's see, no. But it's the same one, same color, everything, LA colors. But this one, as soon as I opened it, I mean, as soon as I opened it, I just went to wipe it on my hand a little bit right here. And look at that. The brush just broke right off. I just wiped it on my hand. The brush broke right off. I don't know, like, I don't know how long they've had this at that store. And then they just finally started just selling everything off real fast. But I'm guessing that's pretty old. I don't know, but I'm guessing. This is the LA Color Browy Wowy Brow Pencil. Um, it does not say the color anywhere, uh, the shade or whatever, it does not say. It is a brow crayon thing. Oh, wait a it does. It says Espresso. Um, CBP. 407 Espresso. I do not know if you can read that, but it is on there. That is what the lid looks like. It's like a darker brown. Here's when you open it up. This is the mark that it'll make on you. But that was it. Here is the little side that you use to like I guess make the color go on your eyebrow okay there was that okay oh um did I even go over these no I did not go over these so there is a few more things that I did pick up there Jordina lip liner 09 hot fuchsia that's what it looks like here is what it makes on your skin it's actually really nice I don't know if it smears so let's just try yep it smears I guess I may have not gave it long enough time to not smear but as you can see it smeared I just put it on there and it smeared but I did put it on thick so I don't know here is another one Jordina lip liner 08 pink 08 pink blast there it is let's see can you read that that's what it says here is it just comes with a black little lid here's what it looks like next to the other color okay it's a lot lighter than the other color Let's see now if it's smeared. Yep, it's smeared. Alright, so now that I have makeup all over me, let's go. Okay, that was it for what I picked up at the Magic Mart. That was on sale. I got all of that for around eight bucks. Quite a bit of stuff, really, but it was all eight bucks. All together, it was eight bucks. I think it was a 70 or 80% sale. So some of it I got for a dollar, some of it I got for like 75 cents. Um, these things, my mother bought me, well, she picked me up this one, and I didn't know if I would like this. It's by Wet n Wild. Um, it is, um, glitter, I guess eyeshadow, or it says it's for face and body only. It is a glitter eyeshadow thing. And as you can see, I have used this a lot. You can see the center of it, like in the pan. See the pan? You can see it on my finger, on my pinky finger. I, I love this. I put this up on the top of my eye, like after I put my eyeliner on. I put this a little bit on top of it just to shine. It is gorgeous. So after she got me this one, 
I had to have another one. I loved it. I've already touched the pan with this at the bottom. So I picked this up at the Dollar Tree. This is the Wet n Wild Color Icon C30, let's see, C35, 6C Spiked. That's what it looks like. I guess it's the same as the silver I have that my mother picked up for me. But look at that. I just take my finger in there, close that up. It's on my finger. Let's wipe this on. Just look at that. It is on there. It's actually really gorgeous, but really the camera don't show how pretty that is. Look at that shine. Okay, so now that I've showed those two, which I think are the exact same, I have this gold. Put my finger on there, mix that up. It is very pretty gold. Now, I also picked up this white when I was at a Dollar General. I picked this white up. It is cute, but it does not go on white. It goes on more of a mixed, like, it goes on clear. It goes on clear, but it's got, like, a little bit of mixed colors in it. Like, I can't explain it. It is bleached. It's just called bleached. Um, wet and wild color icon bleached the number is C 35 1b like it shows that it's white it's glittery but when you wipe it on like here's my finger with it on it when you wipe this on here I don't know like it shines like a, like a little yellow colors just mixed glitter in it is what it shines like Okay, I also have this Wet n Wild pink eyeshadow. Um, I do not know the shade or the numbers or anything. I just know that it's pink to me. And this is what it looks like on the skin. There it is on my finger. Let's rub it on here. Ooh, it's pretty. Very pretty. I really like that. Okay, now I also I have this wet and wild blue. It's more metallic-y colored eyeshadow. It is gorgeous. Darker blue. As you can see on my finger, it's a very dark blue. Very pigmented. Seriously, like, oh my god. That is gorgeous. Very gorgeous. You can see that pink a little bit better now that I moved that light. Okay. So that was for my Wet n Wild um, little single eyeshadows. My mother got me several of them, and I had bought myself some. Let's see, I got a tissue right here. Just wipe some of this off real quick so I don't get it all over every bit of the makeup I have. Okay. So, okay. I have not went over some of the things that I have ordered. I got this on a sale at Ulta. It was marked half price. It's normally 32 and it was marked down to 16 on a sale they had. It was like a 22 day sale. This was the last day's sale, the 22nd of September. I got this for my anniversary. This is, whoops, let me move my hand. This is the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Long lasting, oil free, temperature control. 
and you are supposed to shake this up before you use it. It comes with this lid on top of it. It comes with this extra lid on top of this. You shake it up and then you spray it. It smells really good. It's refreshing. So I bought this. I bought two of them to equal the regular price of 32. Um, I wanted to do an unboxing of this on my channel. So here it is. This is me unboxing it. This is what the box looks like. The bottom, the size, but just the little details on them. The box actually feels really nice. It's got these little drops on it. When you open it, here's it. Here's the setting spray. First time I've opened this one. You take this lid off, like the other one. You take this lid off, and it's ready. You shake it up, it's ready to go. That is that setting spray. It is the same as the first one. The Urban Decay All Nighter Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray. Up to 16 hours wear, lightweight, temperature control technology. This is it. I have wanted that for a long time. It went on sale, so I bought it. Okay, a few more things that we have here to, that I have here to show is this new little mirror I bought. I bought this at Dollar Tree. I shop at Dollar Tree. I shop anywhere that I think is cheap, that I can get a deal. I bought this little mirror. I want a Jeffree Star mirror. But I did not order it. I just bought that Dollar Tree one, so I didn't need to order one yet. But I am ordering it. I can't wait. I love him. I love his videos. He's amazing. So I got this eyeshadow palette, Rimmel London. Rimmel London. It is the red colors and pink. Um, there's some browns. I mainly got it for the red because I had absolutely no red eyeshadow. That is what this eyeshadow is. Um, I don't know if you could tell very good, but that's what this eyeshadow is. It is this. It's this pink and this red mixed together. It is amazing. It is my favorite. I'll take some of the pink and I'll put it over here in the corner. I'll take the red and the pink and mix it and blend it a little bit. And then I'll take the dark red and put it over here in the corner. Oh, it's beautiful. I love this palette. It, it's actually really nice. Like, it was $7 at Walmart. That's where I bought it. And it is gorgeous. Okay. I also just bought this palette. It is BH Cosmetics. Take Me Back to Brazil. 35 color pressed pigment palette. This is it. It is so cute. I love it. It was 18 after tax. It was $19. And um, the next day after I bought this palette, right after, it went on sale for $10.60. $10.60. I was really upset because I had bought it for the normal price. But it's nice. I like it. There's what the colors look like. Sorry, you can see my mirror. The colors are super cute, super bright. Um, let's just touch one. My fingers are a little bit dirty, but they're... Um, I got a clean one right here. So let's just touch this one. I have never touched it. Look how cute. Let's just... I just wiped this off, so... Let's wipe this right here. Oh man, that is gorgeous. So gorgeous. Love the pinks. Pinks is my favorite. But that is the palette I got. I have used this to do several looks. Whoops, sorry. Oops. Um, I have used this to do several looks. It is a great palette. Some people may not like it, but I do. It is a very nice palette. It's, I don't know. Look at them pink mascara on my eyelashes. So cute. Okay. Very nice little palette. Um, 
you get a lot of colors it wasn't too expensive not too outrageous or nothing okay so for my next palette uh, this is the morphe palette it is the 35v it is amazing i've only touched one color so i really can't this is the little thing that tells you the eyeshadows um i can't say too too much about it no i've touched more than one shadow i'm so sorry i touched the purple i've touched the green and i touched a brown but look at this oh man this is amazing i love it just look at them colors I've touched this purple right here and I touched this green because I did a Halloween look to look like a zombie so I put some green eyeshadow over my face because I did not have green paint but this palette is beautiful let's uh, touch one color I do not have anything on this finger um, let's touch something I have yet to touch I have not touched this color. Look how pretty. Let's just put this right here. Look how gorgeous. That is so shining and beautiful. I love it. I have makeup all over me. I am so sorry. But this is gorgeous. I love it. I bought this for my anniversary um, I cannot remember at the moment how much I paid for this it was like I guess it was probably 20 or 25 bucks okay I've also picked up that. oh I've also picked up this palette it is by style essentials stellar eyes eyeshadow collection sorry if uh, you can't see this very good but it does not have a mirror up here I hate that it don't have a mirror but it don't really matter I guess but this is the colors they are actually really gorgeous they are very gorgeous let's just take our pinky and I don't have no more color on it. Let's take our middle finger and we will dip into this green. Okay, we will put this just over top of these colors. Look at that green. That green is so blinding. Um, it's more like a gray green color not a, like a really not too green but it's really cute try to wipe some of these off a little bit off my fingers um, but that was that eyeshadow palette um, I do not let's see to remove makeup mild soap this is not tested on animals not tested on animals very cute um, there is like this see it kind of just me digging my finger in there which I probably shouldn't have dug my finger in there too hard but it's kind of broke off a little bit but not too bad like it's really not too bad but I bought this at Marshall's um, it was I think four dollars three ninety nine or five it says on here follow your dreams very cute let's see I've already showed these I'll show this one this is I don't really I've never really heard of this but I bought this at Burke's outlet it is beauty treats perfecting primer it is the primer I use on my face it comes out white you mix it in and it goes on the face it dries it is not dewy it feels really nice 
eyeshadow is making my hand itch a little bit. But it's very nice. 